Did I just find zebras in the middle of Texas? Hey everybody, how you doing? It's gonna be another day with Life with Surge. And today I'm going in the one direction I haven't ventured to from Austin yet, which is west. You know, I found such cool things just randomly driving around, like the high school video about the businesses inside. I found a $20 helicopter ride. And last weekend, I found that abandoned MiG-17 in a field in Texas. I'll link those videos down below, so check them out. And I'm getting a little bit of a late start today it's almost noon I gotta find something to eat but anyhow come with me and let's see what wonders of Texas we could find today well look at this I found another one of these weird low water bridges this thing's pretty sketchy beautiful out here though So guys, I ended up here in this little town of Cypress Hill. It's too small, <laughs> there's like two buildings in here. But I was driving by and I saw something and this is just totally crazy. You have got to check out what I found. Are, are, are these really zebras? Did I just find zebras in the middle of Texas? These can't be donkeys. <laughs> Look at these guys, they're gorgeous. Yep. Dudes are just hanging out in this pasture like uh, they belong here. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't believe zebras are native to Texas. Well, this sign might explain why there are zebras in the middle of Texas. This is Exotic Wildlife Association, and this person is a member. I I'm, I'm really curious what else they might have back there. I mean, zebras. <laughs> Like I said, you go just random places, you find the most bizarre things. You know, just step out of your comfort zone, go find something different, just travel around, drive around, and you will discover things you didn't even know were in your own backyard. Well guys, I'm now here in Marble Falls. I got hungry and this place here, the real New Orleans style restaurant had really good reviews. So I'm really excited to go check it out. Let's go try it. It looks so good. Oh, it's gonna be hot. Mm. Wow. That's just got a great kick of spice. It's just totally delicious. I'm super happy with this. All right, guys, lunch is here. Look at this thing. It's crazy looking. It's a bed of rice with blackened catfish, shrimp on top of it, and then etouffee sauce. I can't wait to try this. That's the catfish. I don't think I've ever had etouffee, but the combination of flavors here with the blackened fish and the rice and the etouffee sauce, it's got a little bit of kick, but it's not too spicy. And I just couldn't be happier with this. This place is really cool. Loving the food here. Mm. Well, that lunch was amazing. I'm telling you guys, I absolutely loved it. Had just the right amount of spice and just absolutely delicious. So if you're ever in Marble Falls, definitely come down here and check out the real New Orleans style restaurant. Absolutely delicious. I have no idea where I'm going right now. Well guys, that's gonna be it for today. I've driven about 180 miles and I didn't find all the things I was hoping to find, but that's okay. We got to see zebras in Texas. I got to try some really delicious Creole food and I really enjoyed the day. Hope you enjoyed this video. So until next time, please like, subscribe, hit the bell so you get notified when I have new videos out. And until then, please take care of yourselves.